Four wide open looks even to start the second half and didn't uh, didn't hit him, right? But obviously he just he just hung in there and and he got some good looks. He got to the basket of some, um, and then he started really you know kind of controlling the game. We were we were really searching for ways to get him the right matchups and the right play calls and all that stuff, and he took advantage of them for sure. He was he was unbelievable, obviously. Well, we, we were really, I mean, we were ready to go tonight um, at the start. Um, means we responded to, to some, you know, tough losses and tough uh, situations, right? Um, so we got, got ready to go. We did a much better job of executing um, defensively, especially. I thought our defense was really good at times. Um, and then we did a much, much better job of showing some organi organization at the offensive end. We really did. Um, so, and then, and then, you know, we chased the ball down, like 20 offensive rebounds. So we were, we were executing a lot better and playing a lot harder. Things I talked about before the game we weren't doing. Yeah. You, you know, one thing, though, it seems like when Tyrese got going, you had uh, Caleb bringing the ball up, freeing him up around and getting you know, some open looks. So Caleb had a big game, and so did Eric. Yeah, I mean, I think it's part, you know, Keith, you've heard me say I got to learn what's going on with this team, right? It's 12, 13 new guys I'm trying to learn what looks good, what doesn't. And mo most of that is Caleb's pretty good at, at getting the ball in the paint. And, th and then it gives us extra shooting, right? It gives us better shooters to kick out to. Um, so that's kind of just the simple part of it. Um, so it's good. I think it's good. We got a, he's almost like a point forward there that he can play, bring the ball up. And he's usually got a bigger guy on him. So there's not a lot of heat on him back there and things like that. What was, what was your point you were making when you got the technical? I was just trying to figure out, you know, they'd had the ball for 23 seconds and how, <laughs> how, how an error by, by their, Shot clock guy gives them the ball with another added time and added game time and go back to, I don't know, the same thing happened to us a few times. I don't ever recall that being the situation that more clock was put on and the, the team gets to go back to where they started from even after dribbling it around for five seconds. That's it? Go ahead. Yep. Yep, got great hands. Got great hands. Yep, he's always he's always made every scouting report we've ever done that you got to watch Drummond's hands on the pick and roll defense. Yep, great hands. Yep.